and females. The four black ones, if you notice, if you take a good look, they have a red wattle underneath the neck. And then in the front, they have a red wattle. They take about 15 to 20 minutes to inflate that, and that's what you see the red balloons over there. They put their beak on top of it and shut it real fast and it resonates the mating part. On this island, other than the um, <coughs> magnificent frigates, we have the boobies, the yellow-footed boobies. The boobies could go and die, but the frigates can't. So when the boobies come back heavily laden with fish, the um, frigates harass them. And to get away, they regurgitate their meal. And that's how most of the times the frigate get a free meal. They're really efficient. They could soar for over a week. So they don't have to feed as often. They don't have really um, good queen glands. So you notice how they come for the sticks. They don't get wet. You see that? They don't get wet. They, they are called man of war because they fight for everything. You will notice when you throw the twigs. The males, they fight for it. They fight for everything. They harass most birds, but not really the pelicans. The, the yellow-footed um, boobies, they could, as I said, they could dive down. But they still prefer to nest on the same island with the frigates. The other nesting colony is on Lighthouse. You have the magnificent frigates, but on that island you have um, red-footed boobies. They, they, both males and females tend the nest. So when the female is off looking for food, the male has the responsibility.